Hey guys and girls, welcome to the House of Gouldians. Today I thought we would look at ringing some birds and show you how I go about this. So you'll notice that the chicks have already been um, fed by the parents, so we wait until after they do that. And then I'll take the paw, well, the claw of the bird and between my two fingers, and the idea is to take your ring and place it over the first three toes, which are all forward facing. This can be a little bit tricky, so you'll notice that as I go, I'll sometimes battle a little bit, but that's okay. You'll notice at this point that the chick is relatively calm. Um, I find that if they get too squirrely though, then it's easier to put them flat on the counter. Um, So you'll see I've hooked the first couple of toes. Now you, you can see he's starting to get a bit squirty, so I'm just putting him down. Uh, once it's over the first three toes, then you can gently pull backwards with the ring and holding the front three toes. You want to make sure that the bird doesn't roll over and twist its leg, because that can cause damage. Um, and then also, once again, you need to just be careful that you're not bending toes in directions they're not meant to go. It takes a little bit of practice, but you'll see. It's, you'll get the hang of it once you've done a few. And there we have it, that's the first ring. Right, so just looking at the ring itself, it's a club ring, so it's got the GFC on it, it's got my ring number, um, and then the number of the bird. Um, this is an early nest that I had formed ringing, so it starts with four, but obviously as the, the season progresses, you'll get up to however many birds you're breeding. You can see this little guy made a mess. But yeah, that's to be expected. They do get a little bit stressed during this process. Okay, so you'll see I'm holding the claw and then position the ring. Make sure I've got the right ring. You'll also find the first few birds you ring in this new season, you a bit out of practice, so it takes a little while again. This is only the second nest that I'm ringing for this season. Okay, once you go to past the first three toes, you can see you just gently Pull the ring backwards over the back toe, which is facing backwards already. And there you can see it's done. Right. Third chick. Once again, place the ring over the first three toes. You'll see as it went on, it went a bit quicker as you get into practice again. There you go. As I pull over the last ring, just a reminder if you enjoying the educational side of the channel please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also feel free to like and comment in the videos and there we go it's the final one hope you enjoyed it